Hi guys, my name is Ashlyn and welcome to my channel. Today we are doing a makeup look using the ColourPop line. It is their Zodiac line and it is the Crystal Clear Aquarius Eyeshadow Palette. Oof. This eyeshadow palette is so pretty, so pigmented. Like, look at that. Look at that. Looks so good. Yes. So I'm going in. The first color I'm using is the Greater Good. It's just a light like nude color I put it all over the eyeshadow lid to create a nice base for the layered up look we're doing today and then we're going in with this dark brown it's called on the contrary and I'm just putting that bad boy right on the outer half of my eyelid and the edge I'm not bringing it all the way into the tear duct I'm stopping about halfway because we are using this dark brown to create a more in-depth look with the blues that we're gonna be using today. And because it is super pigmented, I am patting that shit on to make sure that I have good depth when I go in with that blue color. So definitely make sure that you're patting that shit on so that you get the depth. See, pat that shit for the depth. Got it, get it, good. Now let me know how this makeup look turns out in the comments when you're done with it. The next color we're gonna go in with is the Free Spirit. And I'm using my pinky so that my natural oils on my pinky can grab the pigment of this eyeshadow color so it is easier to put on my eyelid and there is less fallout and it is a little bit more controlled on placement on my eye. And remember, you just gotta trust the process. Yes, it looks a little bit scary right now, but in the end, it'll all make sense. Just like most things in life, in the end, it all makes sense. And I'm going with a clean brush and I'm blending that shit out. Just to soften that little bit of a line a little bit. I do like a little bit of that dramatic crease, but just soften it a little bit because we are layering. Don't forget that. And we want this shit to look fucking amazing amazing and it will and you can blend in two ways you can blend in the windshield wiper uh, method which is back and forth back and forth or in the wax on wax off and which is in circles like little circles mr. Miyagi and now I am going in with this the fucking prettiest blue I've ever fucking seen and it is called eccentric me and I am just gently patting and kind of just rubbing it on the eyelid not too much because I don't want to create fallout but now you see the point of this nice deep dark brown on the contrary it's creating more depth for this sparkly blue color because if you put just the sparkles on the eye it looks flat but when you layer this shit up, it gives it more pizzazz. And we want pizzazz. Like, now you can really see, like, look how good that shit looks when it is layered. Yas, queen, yas. And then once you get all that on, we're gonna go make sure it's even. How does it look? Yes, she's looking good. See? See the point? That is why we layer the shit on. And now we're going in with a Maybelline Metallic Master Precise Ink. It's like a purplish color. I thought it would look really nice with this Aquarius makeup look. It's very Zodiac themed. What's everyone's Zodiac sign? Let me know in the chat. I say this every video, but I'm just gonna say it again because we need to hear it. Nothing in life is perfect, and especially our faces. Our faces are actually uneven, and that's normal. It's hard to find someone who has a perfectly symmetrical face. So keep that in mind when you are doing your eyeliner, your eyebrows, and even sometimes your contour, depending on your face shape. You know, they don't have to be perfect, they just have to make sense. Like, you can't have one wing that's like super thick and like all the way to your hairline and 
facing up towards the sky and the other one's super thin and pointing all the way down towards the ground. Like, we don't want that. It just has to be similar, not perfect. Because nothing in life is perfect and that's okay. That's honestly what makes life beautiful. I mean, don't you agree? Pretty even, yeah, they look pretty good. And then I'm going in with just a simple white eyeliner just to really make my eyes pop. I used Wet n Wild. And this is called Level Up. This is a mascara I got for my Ipsy bag. If you guys have not heard of Ipsy, it's like $12 a month and you get five products and if you're new like just getting into makeup they have a test like a beauty quiz to help figure out what would work best for you and they give you travel sizes so you really get to test the products out and see if you like it or not i don't know it helped me when i first started getting into makeup so if, if it sounds like a good idea then take a minute and go check out ipsy it's good shit i like it and no they don't endorse me although they should I get my money every month. <laughs> Let's see. Yes, yes. She's looking good. And now we're going in with the color called No More Drama. And it is a Mark Twins beauty product. And there's also a Wet n Wild product, the same that my eyeliner was, the white eyeliner. And I'm putting this on to create a good base for the lip gloss that I got from the ColourPop Zodiac line. The Crystal Clear Aquarius. Like, look at this box. How fucking cute is this fucking box? Like, ugh. It's all about presentation and ColourPop with this, with this line, with the Animal Crossing line, with all your other lines. You fucking deliver, man. Look at this shit. How pretty is this fucking bottle? But yes, take it. It looks good. Put it on. That's what it looks like when it is applied. And now I'm going in with this cool product, another one from ColourPop, called the QT Mark. Get it? QT Mark? <laughs> That's adorable. And it's a little fucking stamp, and it's a star. Like, you need this for your Zodiac look. It just makes sense. Put a couple stars on there, like a galaxy sort of thing. Damn, this makeup look is out of this world. There she is, ready to slay the day. I hope you guys look and feel as beautiful as I do with this look. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Let me know what you think in the comments, and thank you for watching. Bye!